Assalamu alaikum. Wa alaikum assalam wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh. Sir, after a person is dead, all his relatives and all, they give money to the poor, they feed the poor, so that that sawa goes to that person who is dead. How far Islam says about that? As far as when a person after he dies, people do many charity, etc., and that sawab goes to the dead, how far is it true? There are two aspects of it. If a person gives charity, if he gives charity, he'll get the sawab. But there are certain things that after a person dies, only few things that really help him after he dies. One thing is the knowledge. Whatever he spread, that's one thing. The good deeds he has done. For example, he has opened a hospital for free treatment. People being treated, so that is Satya Jariya. And one of them is the children. The Nek Amal, the righteous deed done by the children, how he trained them, the good deeds they do will add on to his account. Otherwise, the account is closed. Person dies, the account is closed. A few things the account runs, the meter it runs. The knowledge that he has spread, the good deeds he has done. There are certain things, for example, your father was sick. He could not go for Hajj. He had the money but didn't have the health. So you go, that's your Hajj Padal. That's for long. So certain things with the Amal done by the children, the knowledge given by the parents to the children, that meter keeps on continuing. Satke Jariya. And the good deeds he has done. But a person dies, he never knew anything, didn't follow Islam, and now you do something, you do charity, and build a hospital for your father, who was far away from Islam. Do you think you go to Jannah? That way all the rich people go to Jannah. Correct? Right or wrong? So money cannot get to Jannah. The Prophet said it's more difficult for a rich man to go to Jannah. So just by doing charity, fine, it was the wish of your father, and the father said, from my wealth, make a hospital. He made a will, alhamdulillah, then he'll get a sawab. But he dies, he was far away from Islam, never prayed, never did anything, and then you are a good Islamic person, and you say, I built a hospital, name of the father, the name is there, Haji so and so, may not have gone for Haji, whatever it is. This will not get him anywhere closer to Jannah. But what did you do? You will go to Jannah, inshallah. Because no bearer of burden can bear the burden of others. That's what the Quran says in several places. Hope that answers the question.